Hello Kerbal Ears. Today's video is just going to be me messing around with the new rig and kind of seeing what I can do with it. First up is a flying car that I made. Uh, it's actually a rebuild of one I made, um, I don't know, a couple years ago. And, well, I just wanted to see how I flew and how my piloting skills were. And yes, I was having a problem with 1.91 and scatter, so my sky is black. I did end up fixing that later. Oh jolly, you still got the skills. Down nice and close, and pull up nice. Not bad for the first time flying in six months. Let's take it around and go through the bridge. That's it, Jolly. Nice and easy. Line it up. Okay, good line. You got this. Down and pull up. Nice! Yeah, go ahead and celebrate. So far, everything's nice and smooth. Uh, no stuttering, no stalling, and usually around KSC is the worst place to fly because of that. Uh, there you go, buzz the tower. Very nice. Why don't you bring it around and land it, and uh, we'll set up some battles out in the desert. Okay, we're still in 1.9. I have an updated HG1 of the part log, and I have the ZBZ525, and I'm just going to see where I was at at the time before the computer crashed. And I see the nice ground glitch has returned for KSP 1.91. Thanks, guys. Contestants ready? Fight! I have to admit, I miss saying that. All right, we have missiles away on both sides. That's one ZBZ down and the first stutter so far since I started recording. Ooh, looks like a good shot on the ZBZ. Doesn't look like there's much left of it. Yeah, it's gliding and falling to the ground.
Okay, pilots, good job. Let's revert back, and next time, let's set up with the CJ-7s. Alright, here we go. The CJ-7 versus the HG Farthawk. Pilots ready, fight! Fart Hog comes around fast and launches missiles almost immediately. That's an AIM-120 missile strike on the CJ-7. It's 2 to 1. Right about here I realized that uh, the weapons manager is jammed and it's stuck on AIM-9s and it can't get a clear target. So it won't activate guns, it won't fire guns, it won't fire the missile, it's just evading, evading, evading. And at the same time I just lost the other fart hog. I don't think this is a fair fight and I think we know how this is gonna end. I think I'm gonna blame BDA for this loss, even though um, I didn't check my settings so I have no idea whether they're correct or not. But I'm still going to blame BDA because it's BDA that locked up. CJ's coming in on the guns. And, oh, there goes some parts. And, oh, it lost his tailplane. I think this is over. Oh my goodness. Did I really make that plane that unstable? I think that needs some help. Yep, that's it. That's the end of the fart hog. CJ wins. So one of the things I did during the time without a computer was pull out my old laptop. And this is the laptop that I did the first PFC on. In there was a backup file of KSP 1.2.2. So I dug into it to see what was in there, and I was quite surprised. In the space plane hangar, I have planes from both PFC-1 and entries for PFC-2, some of the early entries, and some of my own builds I was working on for PFC-2. I instantly started thinking, hmm, Classic PFC with some of the original planes. So, we're going to go through them. The first one is the Boshirukin from Inter. I believe that one was for PFC 2. Now, I took this KSP save and I moved it to the new rig. So, I have it saved on my hard drive here and I can play it here now. Next up is the Palan, AL-46 Palan M. I think that was PFC-1, I'm not sure. The ATF-77C Ray, that was PFC-2. The original drone with all the, the countermeasures before I put a ban on how many you could have. <laughs> uh, 
Amplifier 2. I think that was PFC 2. F-106 Sky Fury, that was PFC 2. Ferry Air Force 1 Falcon AAF, that was PFC 2. Fast Attack Fighter Corvette, that was the winner of PFC 1. GRA Mosquito, I think that was mine for PFC 2, I don't think it did very well. Uh, the Lenzo class, this was one of the coolest looking fighters. And that was the original and I believe the second version is his upgrades to pass tech inspection. Cool looking craft. We have the MG100 Nat. I think that was mine. I think that was something I was doing with Veos. I'm not sure. PF PAF1 Squire. That was definitely PFC2. Well, if you recognize any of these crafts as your own, sound off in the comments and leave your name that you were using at the time of PFC of that PFC and uh, I'll give you credit in the PFC classic. I also have some video files. I have the original PFC one and some other goofball things that I did back then. I might go back and re-narrate some of those because a lot of that was recorded before I had a microphone. Well, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Thank you. I love you guys. See you next time, Kerbal Ears.